Hi guys, welcome back. Subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon to turn on the notifications so that you won't miss any of my videos in the future. Today, I'm so excited to do a collaboration video with Cricut. I'm sure most of you will be already familiar with Cricut. Basically, they make these amazing cutting machines to crafting essentials. Cricut products make it easy to create just for fun, for family, or for friends, or even for a small business. They have so many products available on their website. Today, I will be trying out and reviewing their Cricut Joy and Easy Press Mini. I will be creating some beautiful designs on some baby suits that I wanted to gift to one of my friends who have twins. So I am planning to use Cricut Joy to design their names and later on we can use Easy Press Mini to iron it on to the bodysuits. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. They also sent me some of the essentials that I will need to use with this machine to create my designs. They have different types of vinyls, iron-on vinyls, uh, smart iron-on vinyls, permanent vinyls and so on. You can just check it out by just going to their website. Cricut Joy is actually very very easy to use. You just need to follow the instructions. Even I am using this machine for the first time. So let's learn how to use it together. So first and foremost, you will need to set up Cricut Joy using an app called Design Space, especially made for Cricut machines. You need to download this app using your app store and create an account. And also guys, this app is free to download and they also have one month free subscription in which you can try out as many designs as you want from their app. So as I said before, it's very easy to set up. You just need to follow the instructions. I've already set up my machine and now let's start with our project. First of all, click on the new project. Here, I want to write the names of the twins. So I'm going to choose the design first. They have a lot of templates or designs available on their app. So I went ahead and selected this one which looks so adorable and perfect. So here I am going to use the black iron on vinyl. So first of all you need to measure the length you want your design to be and then adjust the size accordingly. Now let's press make it. So here as we are using smart iron on we don't need to use the mat. So here we need to choose without mat. Then you will be able to see what your design looks like before you actually cut it. Okay so now a really important thing to keep in mind when you're using uh, iron on vinyls or making a t-shirt is that you need to mirror your design it basically means that it's going to cut backwards you'll see it later why it's so important okay because we need to flip it in order to iron this onto the fabric uh, only then will it look perfect you'll understand this in a moment anyway now let's proceed you now need to choose the material that you are using and here we are using smart iron on so let's go ahead and click it always make sure to click on the right material so here you will notice that with the iron on vinyl there are two sides one is the shiny side and one is the matte side so we want to make sure that the matte side is facing up while inserting it to the Cricut Joy okay so when the vinyl has been loaded into your machine simply go ahead and press go let the Cricut Joy do its work Once it's finished, you have to make sure to unload the material. Do not pull the material because it will damage the vinyl. 
So once you have unloaded the vinyl from the machine, it's time for weeding. I'm just going in first with the pair of scissors to cut out my design and like this you can save the remaining vinyl for your future projects. Once you have done that, you will need to peel off the main piece of the vinyl leaving just your design behind. And then I'm just going in with my weeding tool and removing all the bits of vinyl that aren't meant to be there. And you will see that this is why we mirrored our design so that when we flip it over, we can read the name correctly. I hope you understand. Okay. Next, you would want to go up to the Cricut website and look at the heat guide for Easy Press Mini and it showed medium for 25 seconds so let's go ahead with that setting turn on the easy press mini and choose medium and when it turns orange then it means that it's ready to use so now let's take the baby's bodysuit and first iron it to make sure it's wrinkle free and it's not just that actually you need to preheat the fabric before you use the vinyl so that um, you know it sticks on to the bodysuit perfectly one more tip guys if you want to put your design in the middle of the fabric then simply fold the fabric in half and lightly press with your hand to create a crease in the center of the fabric so that it's easy to place the design in the middle now i'm going to place my easy press mat underneath the bodysuit so now we are ready to iron on and transfer. Make sure that your fabric is nice and flat on the area you are applying the design to. Then you can go ahead and position your design. Just make sure that the shiny side is facing up and the underside is slightly sticky so that it will attach nicely and stay in place. Uh, once you are happy with the positioning, then press it down and smooth it out this is going to keep it in place while you iron it then i'm going to go in with my easy press mini and following cricket instructions i'm going to maintain continuous motion for um, 25 seconds in a light pressure once i'm done with that i am removing the easy press mat and then we are going to flip the bodysuit over and press the back so Crooked recommends doing this for 15 seconds on the reverse side so I'm going to go ahead and do that now okay so now I'm going to flip it back over hopefully I'm doing it right because as I said before I am doing this for the first time okay so Cricut recommends not peeling it off until it's completely cooled down. So let's do the other bodysuit in this time. I'm going to do the same thing to this one as well. Okay, so once it's cooled down, you can go ahead and peel it off just take it really slowly because if in case it hasn't stuck to the fabric then you might ruin it by peeling it fast or you know you just want to do it slowly so uh, we can rectify the mistake if there is any oh my god you have no idea how happy and satisfying this makes me oh my god i'm so 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 happy so happy how it turned out really really good so i decided to take one step further i wanted to add a heart design as well so that's what i'm doing here i'm going to go back to the design space app and i'm going to find a heart design that i can use on the bodysuit so yes i'm happy with this design and let's go ahead and press make it again choosing without mat don't forget to turn on the mirror let's choose smart iron on insert the vinyl mat side facing up let's press go <laughs> and now let cricket joy do its magic 
so I'm going to cut it out like I did before and I'll be back soon so here is the design I am absolutely in love with it so now let's go ahead and place it on the bodysuit Now let's use Easy Press Mini to iron on the design onto the fabric. Remember guys the heat should be in the medium level and do it for 25 seconds front and back. Also don't forget to use the Easy Press Mat. Wait until it's completely cooled down before peeling it off. Yay! <laughs> wow I'm super happy with the outcome. I absolutely love it. <laughs> I'm so so impressed by Cricut Joy and AC Press Mini. By the way guys, all the links to the products I mentioned will be in the description box below. Please do check it out. Simply go to their website and have a look. You will be amazed to see the different types of products they have. Oh my god, they are amazing. If you are a person like me who loves to do DIY projects and this machine is for you guys. Oh my god, I love it. And thank you so much Cricut for collaborating with me. Thank you so 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 much. I am really amazed with this. Okay guys, so that's it with this video i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did then please give me a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and comment down below if you have any queries or if you just want to ask something and yeah that's it guys okay bye i'll see you in my next video love you bye